I am going to show you how to copy and paste different shapes. So down here, I put about 30 of every shape so that you don't have to be copying and pasting every time. You can just pull it up there like that. But it's a lot faster to copy and paste, especially if you already changed a shape. If you made a shape go vertical like this, you don't want to have to do that to all the rest of them. If you want more, you can just copy and paste it the same way it is. Or also, I made this shape big and I made it light blue. I don't want to have to redo that every time. So I could just copy and paste this one and get a bunch of them if I want them. So the way to copy and paste is really easy. You're going to click. Make sure you select it so your computer knows which one you want to copy. And then come up to edit. Now, if this menu is not here, you need to click on this arrow because right now the menu disappeared and I have more space to work with, which is great. But to get to the menu, you need to click on this so that these will appear. All right, so click on edit and select copy. Nothing's gonna happen when you copy it, but it is copied. It happens invisibly. And now you have this copied on your clipboard. You just can't see it yet. You're not gonna see it until you paste it. So now we're gonna go again. Let's click here, click off of that and paste. And now I have another one, which is pretty cool. Now I have two. All right, um, let's copy and paste a bunch of these. Maybe I wanna make a fence, that would be cool. Let's make it a little smaller. There, make it a little shorter. All right, I wanna copy and paste it. First I have to click on it. Copy, paste, there it is. I can move this with my mouse. You can also use your arrows to move it around. Now I wanna copy both of these, okay? I'm gonna click off here, hold down, and select both of them at the same time. Copy, paste. And now I'll grab this and slide it over. So if I wanted to, I could keep going and I could make a really big fence of rectangles. That's pretty cool. Now when I do this, it's gonna select that green one too. I don't want that. So I'm just actually just gonna move it over there. And you can keep copying and pasting. There is a faster way. There's a shortcut, which means you can use your keyboard and not have to come to the menu every time. So on a regular PC, which is what I have, I just have a regular laptop, it's Control C. So that means with one finger, I'm gonna push down on Control and hold that button down. And then with another finger, I'm going to press C one time and then lift your hands up. Then to paste it, I'm going to do Control V. So hold down control with one finger and press V with the other and then let go and it should put your images there. Let's look at that on a Chromebook. So this is just a regular PC. Here's a Chromebook. So it's still control here. So with one finger, push down on control and press C to copy and then let up and then push control V to paste. And then if you have a MacBook, you're going to use Command. And Command is the one with this cool little symbol on it. It's a very special button. So you'll hold down Command with one finger, C to copy, and then Command V to paste, okay? So you can do it a lot faster if you just use your keyboard, but you can always come up to the menu to copy and paste as well. And that's how you copy and paste to have many different